Hello Aquarius and welcome to your reading. We are going to get some messages for right now. Whatever spirit feels you need to know about or talk to you about. So let's get into it Aquarius. What's going on for you guys? Alright, so we have inform yourself. There's something to learn. Prayers received and misunderstanding, my bad. Okay, so first and foremost, you and somebody else have had a misunderstanding. Okay, this could be a friend, family member, romance, um, co-worker. You guys have had a misunderstanding, and you'll know if this message applies to you, okay? And this is Spirit saying that you both really desire to get past this and move past this. And it's not as bad or it doesn't run as deep as you might have thought or they might have thought. And through some communication, you guys are going to be able to get this sorted out and realize that what was perceived really wasn't the intent, something along those lines, okay? So you and another person are going to be able to get something worked out. Secondly, Aquarius, you've been putting something out to the universe, and this is the universe responding, saying your prayer has been received, okay? And things are in motion, things are in the works at present. And there's more information to come. There's more things to be revealed. So let's pull some tarot. Alright, Nine of Pentacles. High Priestess. Ten of Wands. Page of Pentacles, the Moon, Ace of Cups, Five of Swords, Eight of Cups, the Lovers, and King of Wands. Yeah, Aquarius, you're feeling really defeated right here with uh, the Five of Swords being in the position that represents you. Feelings of defeat, feelings of being misunderstood, being really, you know, caught up in your head about what's happened, what's been said, what went down. And the energy around you is that of... It's like somebody or something has walked away from you, leaving you in this space of feeling very defeated. And you're hoping that things will get worked out, will get sorted out, or that you, at least at a minimum, can get sorted out within yourself and not feel troubled, not feel burdened by what you're feeling about another person. Um... Yeah, you and somebody, it's like crossed wavelengths. There may have been some things said, there may have been some things done, or this could just be a completely, entirely huge misunderstanding between you and another. But the hope is that things can balance out, we can talk, we can get things worked out. And here in the near future, we do have this Ace of Cups. So this is communication, apologies, conversation. All right, that fight you've had with somebody, that disagreement falling out that you've had with somebody is really, really big in this reading. And it's heavy on your mind. And they feel it too. You're not alone in this, Aquarius. They're feeling bad too. They're thinking about you as well. There's a prayer from their heart out to the universe. Can we just 
talk this out? Can we get this worked out? Could they understand me? And with that King of Wands, one of you is going to take an action towards the other to start getting this sorted out. All right, whether this is them making an action towards you or you making an action towards them, but you guys are going to get this sorted out. Aquarius, I feel that so strongly. And it could be where this person has kind of treated you like, you know what, Aquarius, I don't need you. I got this. I'm strong. I'm independent. I'm going to make this happen for myself, you know. And you feel left in the dust because the energy around you is somebody walking away from you. All right? And they may have gotten a big head. They may have gotten ahead of themselves thinking they were more important than they were. You know, somebody's ego could have went into overdrive. And throughout this whole process, you have remained very spiritually connected to them. And they're not doing as good as they may want you to think at present. They're realizing a few things. Yeah, Aquarius, somebody is hurting over you too. And you might not think that, but they're sad. All right, we got the Emperor and Temperance. Okay, so this person coming through very strongly as fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag, or just having a very fiery, dominating type of personality, but I feel more so like they are coming towards you because the Emperor is the card that represents Aries, Temperance is the card that represents Sagittarius, and the King of Wands could represent Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. And so what I see is this fire energy taking a step towards Aquarius taking responsibility, taking accountability to get things worked out between the two of you. And again, this could be a friend, a family member, romance, co-worker, somebody that's part of your church or a group that you belong to. I'm getting this person got ahead of themselves and now things are kind of blowing up in their face and they're realizing All right six of swords and seven of swords yeah this person can't move on from this either okay um for them it's either what they said or what they did is haunts them okay or they're totally in the dark and they have a skewed perception of what you said what you did what you meant okay but either way they desire closure they don't want to just be left hanging they don't want to be left wondering, you know, what is going on with Aquarius? What does Aquarius think? What does Aquarius feel? Where does Aquarius stand? They're very curious about that. It matters. And perhaps they didn't think it would matter so much, but it does. This is weighing heavily on them, on their conscience. Right, we have impressed that flew out. You know, through this uh, separation of misunderstanding or, or crossed wires, they may be very impressed with you and the way that you've handled things. Okay, we've got happy surprise, focus on goals. Unexpected help and trust instincts. Okay, so 
Aquarius, you haven't reacted the way they expected, the way they anticipated. You didn't lash out. You didn't seek revenge. You didn't, you know, send them a bunch of nasty messages. You just let them walk. You may have been in shock. Like, are you serious? Is this really happening? Did you just say that to me? Or did you actually really do this? You could have been in more of a place of shock. But there's something about the way you have handled this that has surprised them. And they see you, when they're looking at you, they see you as in a good, like you're in a good place, whether you feel like you are or not. Whereas, you know, all of this went down, but here you are still focused, still going, not letting anything distract you. Man, and you know, Aquarius, some of you, this could have been a fallout from a long time ago. And this person is just like catching up with you now. And it's always bothered them the way things ended. And they're looking at you from the outside in. And from their perspective, you've got it together. You know, either way, this person sees you as doing better than they are. Whether you feel that you are or not. That's just how they see it. And they have admiration for you. And see unexpected help and trust instincts. This unexpected help, I feel, is the universe. Where, you know, this person, the universe is going to stir them until they actually take a step forward, take an action towards making this right, making this better. It's something about them taking this step towards you. I don't know why, but... Them taking a step towards you and with this trust instincts this goes back to that high priestess energy again where you do feel them you do feel their presence you do feel their thoughts and their emotions So there's the prayers again. Seems like it's been a long time coming. Slow moving energy. Yeah, and see, there it goes. Some of you, this goes into the way past. All right. Some things were said, maybe not so kind. It's haunted you. It's haunted them. Mm-hmm. See, somebody needs to get something off their chest. You're kind of in a, a place of feeling guarded and protected. See, the energy around you where they were walking away from you. Now it's like their energy is coming towards you with the Six of Swords, Seven of Wands. You don't want to go through this and repeat. And Five of Pentacles. Okay. So Aquarius, there's a fear within you. There's a fear within them of rejection. Okay. And so we have the Five of Cups as near outcome. And the Five of Pentacles there as the, um, you know, total outcome. But what I see by that is this is already the energy that you both have been in. Okay, both of you. You, I feel it's been um, deeper emotional sadness. And it's not to say this other person hasn't felt the emotional sadness. But... I feel they are feeling and experiencing the loss or the absence of you in a big way. Okay, and if this is somebody who's coming back from a long time ago where they're just looking in, they don't know a thing about your life, but what they see, they feel like they've missed out by not knowing you, not being close to you. And at times I feel you've wanted to bridge the gap, but you fear that they would reject you or that it would just be the same thing over again. And there is a fear within them that you would also reject them. All right, Page of Cups and the Empress. Yeah. Aquarius, they're going to make a movement towards you to have some sort of communication. Somebody doesn't want to be in a fight with you anymore. 
somebody doesn't want to be on the outskirts of your life anymore. Somebody's really thinking about you and missing you, and I think you're picking up on that. You got the high priestess, and then trust your instincts. the tower and there's that king of wands again yeah see i think it's going to shock you and look at on the bottom we have the eight of wands i think it's going to shock you when they reach out to you when they try to communicate with you you don't expect that coming from them whether this is something more recent or something you know much longer ago They're very impressed by you either way, the way you've handled everything, where you're at in life, what you're doing. And they don't want to be on the outside anymore. Ooh, look at that. We got the zeros, limitless potential. Reset, relaxation, unknown, surrender, finish line, success, victory. It serves as a timely reminder that anything can be accomplished. If you can dream it, there is no reason you can't make it a reality. If something is in the possession of another person, it is also available to you. So try to remain calm. What's meant for you won't pass you by. Let go of tension. Relax. So look at this. New beginnings. New beginnings here, Aquarius. Limitless potential. They're going to take an action towards you to, you know, speak to you, to get this worked out, to apologize because they genuinely miss you. And man, some of you, this person just looks at you in admiration. And it's like, man, after everything Aquarius has been through, look at them now. Look at me. But look at Aquarius. Damn, I missed out. Mmm, Aquarius. So those are your messages. I am sending you lots of love and light. Take care.